this is Rosa Kelly and I wanted to share with you uh, uh, one of my I, my albums that I just finished adding pictures um, so it was one of my crafty <laughs> resolutions this year is to actually uh, take the time to put pictures on my albums and keep my pictures uh, a little bit more organized because I do have lots of pictures and that I still need to put in albums so yeah so that's gonna be one of my my goals for this year's um yeah so uh, so this album here you have seen it before this is my Saint Tropez mini album and I do have a tutorial on this so for the for this album I made uh, um, I think it's called the easy mini album tutorial which I will link down below and then I embellished the pages in a different tutorial as well so I will um, put that down below also I need to find the link for that because um, I did do this uh, a few months ago so um, so what I did is I finally added all the pictures from my trip to Peru that I just recently went with my girls uh, on November last year uh, for the week of Thanksgiving. So you saw the other uh, album that I did, which is this one. So this one was more like a journal. I was journaling about my book and it was all about our Thanksgiving moments as a family. Uh, so this album is kind of the trip the trip within our trip so we went to uh, uh, three different locations and they're all about uh, the beach and the ocean and fun summer activities so I decided to use my Prima Saint Tropez album that I already had ready uh, so had it all uh, finished so let me just share with you how it looks on the spine uh, so here I use I use a little burlap and some distress uh, just a white acrylic paint these flowers here are actually recollection flowers and this one it's a prima flower and this is just a cute little seahorse embellishment or like a charm kind of like a necklace and i believe i got that at michael's and then so here is a beautiful one of the beautiful uh, papers from the collection so now let me share with you the spine i believe it's a three and a half inch spine uh, yes, uh, and and as you can see, the album closes perfect. It doesn't have an alligator mouth or anything like that, and that is already after I added my pictures into the album. So on the cover here, I just added a family uh, group picture here. It's a little bit uh, dark uh, and it has a little bit of glare, but but yeah. So that was a, a fun fun trip. So let me just go over quickly just so you can get an idea how the album looks like with pictures on it. Um, you, like I said, you have seen the album without pictures. So yeah, sometimes I get questions on how the album looks like with pictures. And let me know if you guys would like me to um, show you the albums after I add the pictures. Um, if that's something that, I don't know, maybe, you know, you want to see it or you don't. And um yeah, because I always do the walkthrough with my albums being empty. So because it's my decision to <laughs> start adding pictures to my albums, uh, let me know. And I'll be happy to, to show you that in a separate video. Um, so here, this is a recollection flower as well. And then I have the burla piece. And this has a piece of Velcro to keep my waterfall in place. So these are some of the pictures from my vacation and I had just enough pictures to fill this album um, but if I had more I have room to put more pictures like on the other side here of my waterfall. I just didn't add more because I didn't have enough enough pictures. Um, so here we were on this. This is like an oasis called Huacachina. Uh, it's three hours away from Lima and it's literally um there is like a lake in the middle of the desert and there's hotels around and then so it's very fun you know you walk around the lake it's actually pretty big and uh and the hotel you know it was really fun to be and then we go and run around the dunas uh and yeah so it's it's all you know like sand and it's 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 amazing and then we did some sunboarding which you will see pictures later on so here this i have a piece of burlap some lace some flowers and this is a picture of my girls we were on the hotel uh, on this one of these hotels here 
so and then this is like the sand uh, I don't know what it called is the car the truck that brings you up into the sand hills and this then starts like going super fast it's, it was really fun the car ride was really really fun and uh, so you go up and down on the dunas and this is my brother and he was taking a selfie with all of us in the background and then this is my daughter Ariel taking a selfie there and as you can see here for this paper I use oh, sorry for this um, pull out I use scraps of paper that I had left over um, to kind of embellish this page a little bit and I decided to leave the back plain uh, you could uh, I could have I don't know the picture here but like I said I had just enough pictures um, to fill the album so over here I have that pocket and then I have a little journaling and I just journal about the places that we were on and I put the, the date and then so here I had a large tag and it said you're my anchor so I thought it was perfect that my brother was there with uh, my daughters and my niece and yeah so that was kind of cute so that tags in right here on this side um, I have Ariel jumping she was uh, doing some funny jumps so I got one where she was actually on the air jumping and so this opens up like that and this is uh, Ariel and Tessie when they were on the on the car here with their seatbelts on where's the car yeah on this car uh, waiting to you know waiting for the adventure <laughs> this is how Tessie looked like once we arrived her hair was so messy it was so cute uh, so here is when they were actually going on the uh, sand uh, sandboard. Oh my god, it's a it's a very high hill. It's kind of like uh, you know like uh, like snowboarding. So, but they were actually laying on it because we didn't know how to do it. But yeah, it was really fun. And we went to a small hill for kids, but it was still super fast once we uh, got the gravity going there. So I journal a little bit about that in here. And I have another pullout, and this is uh, them a picture of one of those cars. But it was this was later at night um, in our hotel because they had some of the cars. Uh, they were part of the hotel, uh, so yeah. So it's gonna. Oh, well, they were inside the garage in the hotel. So over here we walk away. We went out and walk around that. Uh, like if I go back here and show you uh, around the lake, there are restaurants and. So yeah, so we went around and went to one of those restaurants and then I was trying to find pictures that were small enough to, um, the pictures were actually 4 by 6 but I kind of cut them into the uh, three and a half by three and a half size, you know, actually three and a quarter by three and a quarter size here to be able to fit on my waterfall. And like I said, if I would have more pictures, I would have been able to put more here but I had just enough. This was later on at the beach on the next day, but I was just looking for the small pictures. And this was at the restaurant they were playing some games. Okay, so this is a picture at the beach. And this beach was actually, it's an hour away from here. So we stayed at a different hotel on this side. Uh, and this, it's called Paracas. So Paracas is like a bay and it's it's a be it's a beautiful the water is so peaceful it's so beautiful so this is a picture of Tessie and it was kind of windy so her hair was just flowing crazy and I thought it so cute and so over here when we open this on this side uh, this is her again and this is on the swimming pool in the hotel and this is when we were sitting on the beach uh, so yeah so this is me and my sister-in-law and yeah we were just sitting on some chairs and it was kind of windy like I said so we weren't expecting to get in the water but then they <laughs> ended up uh, jumping in the water and this was at the restaurant uh, on that you know in the restaurant was on the on like the fourth story and it had this beautiful view and so yeah oh so here are some more pictures of uh, them just walking and they ended up getting fully completely wet <laughs> But yeah, there were some people kayaking, and yeah, so thank God we had an extra uh, change of clothes when we went to the to the beach. And here is at the restaurant that I was saying up in the um, it's like a four story, and it's the restaurant sits up. It's kind of like weird because it's all open, and so you have these wonderful views. But I was kind of 
scared of the altitude because it was really open. Even the stairs going down, it was kind of open. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, so over here, it was we went to um, to a different restaurant, and the girls were just sitting out there on the cute uh, that bench. It was it's like a wooden. It was carved, and it was just so intricate that I had to take a picture of that. So beautiful flowers here. These flowers were from my stash, and I believe they were all uh, from Recollections. And this is just us in the swimming pool at the hotel, and yeah, just having a great time together. And same thing here. We were eating breakfast in the hotel on the rooftop. The hotel was on the roof, and I'm oh, sorry, the restaurant was on the roof of the hotel. And yeah, it was it had a wonderful view all around. And yeah, so here's us again, and just having a great time. And also here, we were in a different city, and we sat here and had some artisan ice cream. And these ice creams were, oh my gosh, so good. So, so good. So yeah, we decided to take a family picture there too. And then here, this was the same place where we had the ice cream, was the same city. And this is where you go wine tasting and pisco tasting. So we were just walking around the winery here and the girls were just like pretending to pick on some grapes. Uh, so yeah, they had a great, great time here. We're just walking around <laughs> saying hi. And then this one, I just journal about our trip and the date again and again on the back I have a picture of Ariel and this picture was actually taken in Lima but it was uh, I was able to fit it on this uh, like I said I had just enough amount of pictures for this for this album and then here uh, you open it up and this is a picture of the girls at the airport once we, when we were leaving Lima so it's actually, these pictures go actually after these ones, but like I said, I was trying to um, fit the spaces here because I created the album and I had no idea what pictures I was going to put in. It was a little bit challenging to accommodate the pictures uh, the way we, they were taking on the trip and at the same time to fit, you know, fit with the layouts. Normally, I print the pictures and then I create the album based on that, but this was actually fun and it wasn't a, it wasn't that difficult to do and then on the at the end here I have like a little booklet and so this was another picture when we were leaving uh, Paracas and then we just went to uh, Lima and then we took some pictures on the Lima downtown at nighttime and it was it was really really fun so Ariel uh, it was just Ariel and me and my mom because uh, the other two stayed home and they were playing with their cousins and their friends that they have back home and so yeah so it was a very fun trip so such a great memories that um we built together and yeah we're kind of sad my husband wasn't able to go because it was such a short trip and he had to work he's doing school so yeah but yeah i just wanted to share with you a little bit of my trip and mostly i want you to see how the picture the album looks like after you add the pictures it's just completely different it's just i feel like the pictures give the album a life they give the album a purpose and so that's gonna be uh, my goal for this year to actually add pictures to my albums <laughs> so i want to thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time Bye bye